Okay, everything's... Mm -mm. So, I changed my YouTube name to Every John. Well, my mom figured, thought that name was better than my other name, but that's not what I'm talking about today. I'm talking about a post I made, what I think is internet and real life cancel. And you know what it is? Hate speech and haters. There's something called feelings. You may have it yourself. Well, I don't think some people have feelings or with videos I find on YouTube, comments and other things. And this is the definition of hate speech. Yes, this. Now, people will love the idea of mixing it with free speech. That's the problem about it. The reason why hate, haters and hate speech is annoying annoying as heck or is heck is always you have the idea treating treating like crap maybe yourself will like the same way when someone's mean towards you yeah because I think everyone loves and enjoys insults they can just smile most people act most people would act sad seeing these types of comments on their content it's the same idea of getting dislikes on their YouTube videos the only videos I dislike all the video went and hate towards other stuff like that. It should not exist on the website, that is my point of view. It's a problem on YouTube and I was when seeing or hearing about thinking to myself, a website should focus on the safety of the users. Some people love the idea of saying, saying it's their opinion. Sure it is our opinion to think people should not pay attention to you and block and report and and treat you badly as a response. The best idea, if you hate something, if you dislike the video, just leave the video. The reason why I was reading my whole entire post is because it's the, it's the honest truth. Feelings hurt. Uh, <clears throat> words hurt. Actions hurt. That's the bottom line. It does. And I don't smile when people insult me or stuff like that or comments or stuff. I'm thinking to myself, you are paying attention to something that you could just leave alone. As I said, if you don't, if you dislike the video, just leave the video. I do that all the time when I find those videos. I just go, hmm, oh, it's someone playing a video game. I'm not liking that they're loud and stuff I don't find unfunny. I find unfunny, so I just leave the video. That's what I would do. It's the same idea about anything. There's a door. Why don't you use it? And I think that's the worst part about well, the internet and other people is that some people don't understand that feelings exist. And what they think is free speech is hate speech. And hate speech is against the law. Yeah, there's laws all of the world over it. And YouTube tries to stop hate speech, but not free speech. That's the good part. And it, it just it, it's it just drives me crazy. It, it does. Because that's what cancel is. Cancel is like hate. It affects, it hurts, and it kills people. And YouTube and other websites enjoy every minute of it. There's YouTube users uploading it and all this other content. And it just drives me crazy. It, it does. I focus, as I said a number of times, I focus on video games because video games have never insulted me and make me feel sad and hurt my feelings while we don't try because they're programmed that way. But it's just ridiculous. I don't want to hear how much she hates someone and want them to die and want them to kill themselves or something like that. It's just stupid and crazy. Like seriously, seriously, I, I'm sorry, that was one of my videos, it's, 
I recorded it. And I recorded it and it, it and the editing is completed. So don't mind that. But it's just it's just stupid. And I also I'm making another one that's an alternative name that I'm gonna post called Internet and Real Life Cancel is Hate. Because it always has been hate. It is. That should be the title of this, but I'm going by my post name. And it's just it's just kind of sad when you think about it. Like, uh, here's one thing: when I when I'm jealous of a gaming channel, like let's say Vonios Gaming or Lick Speak Jimmy, a typical gamer, I don't rant. I don't dislike their videos. I don't do anything. I try to actually, I actually try to be inspired by the su success. I try to make videos on games they have played. Try to make funny scripts. Try to try to make something that can get people's attention, like like finding an Easter egg or finding something that no one has ever thought of, or try to actually be unique with my things. It's just it, here's one thing. It's the same thing if it was a file. Like, imagine if there was a fire on your house and you did nothing about it. And you just said, oh, yeah, d d d d someone else put it out. What would you think? I would think that I could actually have done something. Rather than just rank fail, while the fire go goes up, while your house goes up in flames. It's just, it's just so annoying. It's not what YouTube is about. Here's the thing. At least with the family channels, the toy wrapping channels, and the other channels about toys and kids, at least they're doing something that's actually useful and helpful. And some other channels that actually about shoes and companies. But my point is, is that it's just stupid and it's ridiculous. It is. It doesn't help anyone. It doesn't help you. And that's bullcrap.